Hey everybody, Red October. I uh, was watching a video from Joe Rogan. I'm subscribed to his channel and he puts out these little several minute videos. And the one video I was watching, the subject or the topic was there. there's too many people. There's just too many people on the planet. There's too many people in these major cities. Now, what do you do? You know, what? I mean, how do you control it? I don't think there's any way to control it. How do you control the flow of people moving to, or migrating to a city because they're like, hey, the you know, economic status is great, there's jobs. Uh, where I live at in my part of Texas, there's people that come from all over the world. We have a lot of people from California, people from Chicago, Florida, and I, and I think to myself, why the hell are you moving here? Like, stay your ass over there. Um, but these days, people travel and move around so much that it wasn't like that that I remember growing up. People kind of stayed in their own regions, but because of military, um, universities, people going to college, and jobs have caused people to migrate in certain parts of the of the country, depending on the economic status or maybe living conditions better, whether it be resources or just maybe a better a lifestyle living. They're not living in, in, in bad places like the ghettos or whatever. And, you know, the, the topic in my mind, which I'm sure other people that are concerned into SHTF or just survival or just end times or whatever, um, it comes circling back around. It's like, how do you control population? How do we not get to that point where we're just like overpopulated? And I think um, the overpopulation, uh, it, it takes its toll on everyone. I mean, we get frustrated with each other. There's too many cars on the road. I'm trying to get home. It takes me almost about an hour. And I'm just like an hour to work, hour back home. Well, maybe not a full hour, but 45 minutes or so. And I'm like, it wears. It wears on you. It wears on you. You get frustrated. There's, you know, people are, their cars are breaking down. There's an accident. And then, like, all hell shuts down on the highway. And it's like, there's just too many people. And all the resources are in the city because otherwise, if they were... If I could find a job, a good paying job, sustain a, the lifestyle that I have now in the country, I think we would have moved to the country. But people that move to the country always migrate back to the city because of jobs. So in essence, they're taking up space on the road. They're taking up a job um, that somebody else could have. People that migrate to the city are taking up a job. They're taking up space. They're taking up resources. But how do you control that? Because every every city wants people to migrate to move their city and they want to flourish I'm rambling here I know but think about that there's too many people and I'm sure you thought about it in your area and you're like how do we how do we control this how do we depopulize this volume of people we certainly don't want to kill people we don't want to see a um, a virus outbreak where people just start dying left and right because you and I get impacted by jobs, resources, services, our loved ones, people that we know to end up dying. Uh, we don't want to see war to depopulize our country or this planet. But I really think that sometimes that that uh, that's been a reason why some countries have gone to war because of depopulation. It's never come out. And I think it could be a reason in the future why countries do go to war. Maybe it's, it'll give them a reason to pop off a few nuke bombs and depopulate major cities. And imagine wiping out a major city like Houston or L.A., you know, or New York. I mean, the sheer volume of people that would no longer be around would free up a lot of resources, free up a lot of space, free up a lot of jobs kind of put that balance back in place is that good is it bad let me know what you think is there too many people on this planet is there just too many people where you live at that you wish the population would go down but but you you hope to still sustain the economic growth and the the jobs where we can still live comfortable our town can still flourish but we don't want the people uh, that come with it all right, right out.